North Texas pastor indicted after attempting to pay suspected prostitute $150. All the flesh is weak. We got ourselves a John, and I'm now talking 316, looking to do a little community outreach, pastor, looking to lay your healing hands on a few of the sheep that have strayed a little further from the flock, sheep of the night, if you will. A North Texas pastor is facing a charge of soliciting prostitution after he was arrested in May, according to Plano Police. A North Texas prostitute sounds like you're going to get your itch scratched, but you're going to walk away with a completely different itch afterwards. Bang, bang, bang for your buck. The former senior pastor at North Dallas Community Bible Fellowship Church in Plano, 51-year-old Taryn Lee Dames, was taken into custody May 2nd. According to an arrest warrant affidavit, the former pastor's arrest was part of a sting operation. Plano police regularly conduct a demand reduction operation targeting those soliciting commercial sex. The warrant says, this is definitely not the first freak booty pastor story that I've come across during my news excursions, and it won't be my last. There was Travis Clark. He was actually a priest in Pearl River, Louisiana. He was caught filming a threesome, him and two other women, on the church altar. Then there was Herbert Irving Miller, Woodbury, Connecticut. He was a pastor that was giving couples methamphetamine to watch them have sex. When these guys go off the path, they don't stray a little bit. They go all the way out there. On the evening of May 2nd, that was a Thursday, not a Sunday, Dames called an undercover officer and agreed to pay a person he believed to be a prostitute $150 for sex, according to the warrant. Tricking with the collection plate money? Nice. The officer provided Dames with an address, and the former pastor arrived at a motel shortly after. Court documents state a North Texas motel. Can you say Lysol wipes? Dames was stopped by another officer at the intersection of G Avenue and Central Parkway East, where he was arrested. After being read as Miranda warning, Dames told officers that he arrived at the motel to meet a friend. Yes, a friendly friend, the friendliest of friends that you can ever meet. The warrant says it was at that point that Dames started experiencing a medical episode. Well, isn't that convenient? What medical episode did he have? Maintaining an erection for more than eight hours after taking Viagra on your way to have carnal relations with your North Texas harlot? This was divine intervention, buddy. They stopped you from getting something that you can't pray away. He was evaluated by the fire department and medics determined his vitals were low, but Dames refused to be taken to a hospital according to the warrant. His phone was also seized when he was taken into custody. You're out there looking for a hooker. You should be going to get a checkup. He was named the church's senior pastor in 2015. According to North Dallas Community Bible Fellowship's website, the church has not yet responded to the Star Telegram's phone call or email requesting comment. What are they really going to say? He's a whoremonger? The church told Star Telegram media partner WFAA-TV that Dames was removed from its staff in May due to a moral failure, and we all know what that is now. There you have it, kids. Taryn Lee Dames. Now you know where your collection plate money is going. Maybe you might want to put a little less this Sunday to keep your pastor from freaking off.